not bad. My hull just went up from 2300 to 2700. Nice. Did you use, did you have the standard lightweight one on there and just mod that one? Yep. It doesn't really add to the weight either, which is cool. Yeah, it doesn't add at all. And you still get a decent bit of resistance for most ships. It's cool. I mean, in hindsight, I probably would have done, I might even change them later on, is just update the lightweight one or go on to military, which gives you a general boost overall and just use the shield boosters for the, uh, the resistances. Is that well, way I've, got, I've got hull, mod, hull reinforcements in the uh, optionals anyway. I just, where I normally stick the, the module uh, reinforcement, that's where I put the shield boost. Uh, because I don't need the module protection because I've got a monster power plant, which is beefed up yeah. in itself. Did you, did you check it out at all, the flechette launcher? No, no, I haven't. Check it out, I think you'd be pretty impressed. It's one of those ones where you fire, hold the button in, wait till it's at the right distance, because the, uh, the target and I can ready cool goes from orange or whatever it is, or cream into red, then you let go. But it actually damages through the shields. Still yeah. does the power plant and everything, so it's pretty cool. But you got to be good to do it. It's like lobbing cannons and stuff. It's the fire projectile is not too fast. But uh, I tried it myself, and it's pretty good. But uh, I'm not very good with those sorts of weapons anyway. But the damage they do, and someone knows what they're doing, is uh, quite extensive. As, um, I saw one the other night, actually. He was in a Viper. And he was actually fighting a Chieftain. Chieftain was all decked out. And having a good battle, and I thought the Chieftain was going to beat him easy. Because on the first, first pass... The chieftain ripped off the viper's shields and had about 10 percent hold damage we just kept firing and firing you see his power plant go down and down his power plant got to about halfway and he was a dead duck in space three or four more shots boom blew up oh, be right back new kittens get kittens are getting into stuff <laughs> kittens fuck you know <laughs> yeah love my cats <laughs>
Always winning, bird. Always winning. Nice bird online. Uh, I just started streaming. He popped on. All oh, right. Hi, oh, bird. How you doing? Just farming mats, bird. Just farming mats. I'm gonna build up a uh, condo, and I just need to stock up on mats before I go super engineer it. How the pretty chat's going? She's eating now. My older cats are not adjusting well. I gotta sort out the pecking order after a bit. Well, I got one that's not mean to her, but I got a black cat that's constantly hissing at her. got her yesterday so it'll take it probably a couple of weeks for them to get used to each other oh yeah note to stealth must stop crashing into planets unlock some of the guardian stuff that'll be fun I still have that on the to-do list but it's down a little bit further on the to-do list it wouldn't take you too long to get the one for the FSD boost which is probably the one that everybody's after yeah it only takes about an hour yeah got one you go with bird it's not that far either Took me an hour to unlock the FSD booster and an hour to unlock the shield uh, reinforcement.
Yeah, you want that booster because it's nice um, being completely full of limpets and still being able to jump 40 light years in a combat build. Tempted to make a lightweight Class A scanner instead of this Class D. What's the difference in weight? It's not that much, is it? Oh, the scanner, you mean? Yeah. Oh, scanner, you lose a hell of a lot. Then you can get a hundred tons down to about seven tons on the scanners on the lightweight. Yeah, I need to. Well, I've got a lightweight Class D. But I think I kind of want the range. Um, look at the lightweight class A's. Look at the distance. Because uh, the A's is pretty good. You'll still get the lightweight, lightweight class A down pretty low. Not that far off what the D is. You'd be surprised. I can't remember exactly, but I've got them. Uh, I've got a couple already modded. Because yesterday, bird lips was seeing a lot of targets that I couldn't see. Yeah, same as me. I mean, I I now have my uh, warrant scanners and my uh, discovery scanners to uh, lightweight but I get the A ones now on all of them and the life support as well I just get A's now and lightweight them or long distance whatever you want no, I don't worry about the life support because uh, I can synthesize life support yeah yeah I just do it purely for the fact that uh, I suddenly realized that uh, it was it weight it weighed the same as a uh, D1 for seven minutes, so why not have it for 25? That way I can keep fighting even though my canopy's gone and losing oxygen. I know I've got plenty of time. I don't have to worry about it so much because that's the biggest worry when it goes. Got seven minutes to get back.
Yeah, but realistically, when your canopy's gone and you're sucking oxygen, how long are you really going to stay out there and fight? I mean, come on. No, it depends. In the, um, obviously, it's down to money. In the Corvette, depending on what I'm fighting, probably not long, but in a smaller ship like the crate, I did the other day, oh, just keep going. If it blows, it blows. If I win, I win, because it's obviously cheap enough on the rebuy. Just adds to a little bit, of, little bit of fun. Yeah, because the tendency is to panic, isn't it? When it once it once it all goes, it's like whoop 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 whoop. But if it's not going to cost you too much, and you've got a strong hull, if you've done your hull, yeah, they last quite a while still. I tend to only think about getting out of dodge if it gets that bad. And when the hull gets down to about fifty percent, forty percent, like I do with the Thargoids, then I think about leaving. Depending on how the battle's going, on you know how badly damaged they are, how many I'm getting attacked by, that sort of thing. Well, I got mine set up to where if I'm getting pounded, one of the first major systems to actually go out is life support. If my power plant's getting hammered. Yeah. <sighs> if I set it to priority three, then uh, the life support will go out before my shield generators do and all that jazz. Yeah. So it gives me an idea of when I'm taking too much damage on the power player. Another thing I've never really played with, going for the armored power plant. Might be an idea. Well, they're awfully heavy. About 300% more. Yeah, I know, I noticed. But if, it, if it's a combat, if it's a pure combat ship, then obviously you don't mind sacrificing because you know everybody always targets the power plant first. Hey boys. How do you do? Yeah, I guess so. Um, I got a pretty good uh, phone call about an hour ago. Yeah. Sir, service. Uh, I was offered a uh, job for a weekend. For a what? For this weekend. Oh, you got you offered a you got offered a job for this weekend. Oh, was it to become a masseur? No, 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 no. Uh, basically, I have to go on to a how how can I say it in English? There's this uh, group. Um, fuck it, I have to uh, translate in into English. All right, take your time. You let me know what happens. I'm just going to need to put down to the shops. We'll be back in about 15. Okay. So, yeah, what I have to do, basically, I got offered a job in a fair for this weekend. Oh, okay.
and my pay would be about uh, my pay would be twelve euros per an hour. That's not bad for working at a fair. I can't, uh, and it basically uh, it will be uh, like um, that. I don't have to pay a tax uh, for it. Hey Dynamo, yeah. how you doing? Happy fourth. How much you got? Uh, how much funds you got in game now? Um, not enough. But you never have enough. But how much you got? Two hundred and twenty-nine point one million. Oh, you're making uh, getting there, getting close. Yeah, I have been uh, slacking off a few days. I wasn't having a few feeling to do the exploring thingy. Yeah, it happens. Yep, take a break. If you're getting tired, take a break. Do something else. Yeah, well, I would like to do something else at the moment, but uh, I don't have any idea what to do. Well, you got enough money to build yourself a crate. Build what? Crate, the new uh, crate, multi-purpose ship. Well, I was planning to do that with uh, Anaconda. You can do it just as well in a crate without having to spend seven hundred million. So where could I find this ship? Should be in Alliance space, right, Clear, uh, Creed? If he doesn't have access to... Shinrata. Yeah, he was working on his exploration rank so he could unlock Shinrata, but... Uh, yeah, I don't know where else. I always go to Shinrata for my stuff. How much you got left till uh, Elite? 46% left. Yeah. So that is about would, 8 would, to 90 mil. Yeah, I would wait. I don't wait until you get to Shinrata because Shinrata's got everything all in one place so you don't have to jump around and it's at a discount price. Yeah. So by the time you get the 80 or 90 million, you'll have enough to buy the crate and have plenty left over for rebuys and stuff like that. I would have about a little bit over 30 mil. I mean, 300 mil. Yep, because you can always build yourself a separate trade ship or anything like that, because a crate's an excellent multi-purpose. But you will have to unlock engineers, which is going to take you a while. And the crate, you could do that, because you could set it up multi-different ways. But you'll want to unlock engineers, grind mats, do all that stuff. Yeah, it takes a long, it takes quite a while to unlock engineers.
Uh, yeah, I'm gonna buy something Dynamo. It's gonna be a Parka Conda. Just basically take it anywhere, park it, let the turrets kill everything, farm mats, use it to kill sentries, do sentry missions. It's gonna be my money making uh, ship. Farming ship, all in one. If I do the grade five, I can get it down to 32 tons. So I'll have to go to the trader, scrounge up some nets. You're a metallic. I thought I heard a metallic, maybe not.
Dynamo. I do have Star Citizen, but every time I load that game up, it's nothing but a high disappointment. It sucks. Yeah, I got a AMD 1800X Ryzen. And I got a NVIDIA 1080 Ti, 16 gigs of DDR4 RAM. I think I should be able to play Star Citizen on AM.2 drive. Should handle that, no problem. Hey Bird, did you ever take a look at your joystick and try and get that fixed? This one's nice. The my little kitten is chasing around the one cat that doesn't like her. Let me know how that ends up for him.
One thing I just realized, Bird, is you'll have to do that with your SRV steering as well. I didn't realize that until I started coming out here on the SRV. I got my hands free on my SRV now and I got no drift. Super nice. Yeah, which engineer is that? Is that uh, the Sarge? Oh, a trading I will go. A trading I will go. She the one that does like the the missile uh, enhancements and stuff like that. Yeah. Who are you trying to get after that?
Hey, and I'm back. Welcome back. Welcome you needed Jabba cakes. It was hard. I resisted it big time, so no Jabba cakes. But I did buy myself a bounty bar. So I'll have that a little bit later. What is a bounty bar? Oh, what's a bounty bar? Uh, okay, trying to Chocolate think of something. Silly. Yeah, she's got chocolate on the outside, but inside it's almost like a desiccated coconut. Defecated, yeah, got... defecated coconut? <laughs> yeah, that's right. <laughs> defecated coconut, yeah. That sounds disgusting. That's really so... nice. If you like coconut, you like chocolate, then it is nice. It's only got a little bit of chocolate around it. Chocolate I can do, coconut not so much. Yeah, chocolate and coconut go nicely together. Yeah, I kind of figured that. that sounds gross. Hey, sport. Oh, I'm just filling up on Mass Dynamo. I haven't set a time limit on it. I'll just keep doing it till I'm bored. I'd really like to do it so I don't have to do it another time. I can just uh, be good on mats for a while. Yeah, nothing more frustrating when you would start engineering and instead of good doing what you want to do, you have to end up searching for the match you want to engineer before. I think it's really frustrating. Ah, thanks for the follow. Appreciate it.
You still grinding mats, Mem, or are you uh, off to do other things? Uh, I'm about done, really, on the uh, on the mats. So I was going to just go finish off the uh, condom. Uh, just go check it out. had enough to finish the sensors. So now I'm done, and no more mats. Cool. Yeah, I'll be done in a few more minutes. Why do you want to go do something? No, I'm I'm stuck farming mats for a while. I was just wondering if you were still farming. No, I'll be stopping in a minute, and I'll uh, take the ship out and give it a give it a test in a red site. <clears throat> See how fun it is. I'll come join you. I gotta go wake up my little one first before she sleeps the day away. No problem. Ooh, look at that pretty ship.
really disappointed we don't have 4th of July paint jobs. Perhaps you should take a note into FDEV so they can appreciate uh, the American They could have gave us a little stars and stripes we could have painted our ships with. You got one for a couple of smaller ships. I think the Viper's got one, isn't it? How about a ship I'd actually use? <laughs> There, scanner's all done, and I'm back up over 40 light years. Cool. I think I'm about done, actually. Where are you now in the uh, in the bubble? Me? Yeah. Levi Gateway on the white jump from Chicago. Right. I'm up uh, just one jump past the planet we was on last night. Did you want to go to HR? Yeah, I think that'd be a good one. Oh, here we go. This would be my last stop. Three, whatever they may be. Oh, three metallic meteorites to finish off. How uh, cool is that? Very nice. I ran into a few of them earlier, and now I'm not seeing any. No, there's no guild type mechanic in this game, Dynamo. They're talking about uh, later on this year implementing something what's called squadrons, which I think will be similar to what a guild would be. But that's not till later this year. surprised they don't implement something like EVE called corporations because corporations are huge in this game FTC wise Yeah, it's a good run, that. Last night like this morning, I've uh, managed to get everything right back up again. Molly's up to 133. Moby, I'm up to 117. Ruthie, I'm up to 38. 
Antimony up to 55. Cadmium up to 35. Four and Arsenic up to 76. Yep, cool. They're all the ones I was pretty down on. Good. That was a good run, those, uh, those three planets. Literally within one jump of each other. Perfect. No, <laughs> pretty much this SRV you see is what you get as far as land vehicles go. Um, you can doll them up with different paint jobs and stuff like that, but they're all the same mechanically. Calling ship, then on my way. Sent you an invite, ma'am. I'm right back, ma'am. I'm sitting at Key Enterprise right now in HR. Okay, no problem. Alright, I gotta let my dog outside. I'll be back in a few. Let's throw a go. That's the game music, Dynamo.
I am back. Welcome back. I'm just on my way there now. I really hate it when I delete an email, those in-game messages, and then as soon as you jump into Super Cruise or something, the same ones pop right back up. I may have to turn it off all together. Yeah, there is a filter system, isn't there? I mean, do we ever get any messages in there that we think are really important that we don't want to miss? I never have.
Go on, Mordu. What? I'm just jumping in the system now. Do you want to go straight to the Hazres? Yeah, I'm already here. I got my beacon up. Okay, cool. I haven't got any uh, normal stuff. I've been like Healy beams or repair limpets because uh, I haven't got that far yet on this on this build. I oh, know. How's she working out in the hazardous voice? Because it's the first time you're using it now, isn't it? Yeah, it's doing okay. Can you hear the uh, rear turrets going off? Yep. It's cool, isn't it? Uh, ship looks good with the pirate faction thing on it. Very nice. Yeah, it was machine gun shoot mate. Yeah, short work of it. They oh, got a fighter with it. Oh, okay. Very nice.
Yeah, I've always had condos and clippers all over the place, and now I've got just two sidewinders. You mean you're trying to say as soon as I turned up, they're all gone? Yeah, cow beastie is too. 